Hurricane Laura is about to hit, and I am at Walmart. You want to see what it looks like right before a hurricane? Oh, the reason that I ran in there in the first place, believe it or not, is not because of hurricane snacks or anything vital to prepping for a hurricane. It's because I needed an SD card and we originally thought that the camera came with it and no, no it did not. But yeah, also got some zebra cakes and some Nutty Buddies and then some bread. Because you can never have too much bread whenever, you know the power might possibly go out because ham and cheese sandwiches because you want to use your ham and cheese then peanut butter and jelly sandwiches and usually for hurricanes we have barbecues and so yeah bread would be useful for both hot dogs and hamburgers and yeah the, the bread aisle was kind of lacking anyway and so I figured well just buy one loaf of bread and call it a day so I realized I never actually opened the vlog. The vlog, the vlog, the vlog. I never opened the vlog. So, hello guys. Richard. Would you like to say hello, Richard? What's up, nerds? Hi. 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 That was yeah. very loud in my ear. She is Marshall. She <laughs> loves Marshall. Yes, that. I However loud it is for you, I promise. I it's louder. Oh you're, oh, you're a kitty? Then act like a kitty. Yeah. Yeah. Mama. I live in the zoo. Hey, Mama. Huh? Can you show everybody to your ah. new? I would love to do it if y'all stop moving me around. Iris, are you okay, baby? Yeah. Okay, you need to stop pushing my chair because it pushed her head into the desk. Let's not do that, okay? Okay. 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 Like I am. I am trying to. Can I do it? Mm-hmm. <gasps> Look how little it is. You're welcome. Yeah, Richie got it for me. I did. It took me five years. <laughs> what he means by that is that he got it as his five year present for working for his company and yeah, decided to get me a little camera. Thank yeah. you, baby. You're welcome. There were really only like three things that I would have gotten. One of them was a watch, because I like watches. Who uses a watch now unless it doubles as a phone? Classy mother truckers. But, <laughs> you, do you not remember that I got all of my friends' pocket watches? Yeah, and, but that's a pocket watch. And engraved flasks. And, engra and engraved flasks for yes, our Yes, I do remember that. Classy. Yes. Now, what? What? Would have been a watch, or it would have been there was a Black and Decker um, three uh, uh, triangular LED light with a hook on it that you could hang in. It was like this big, and it was battery powered. It was like a lamp. It was a lamp LED lantern, and I'd gotten that one. And then I saw the camera, and I was like, "Hey, Lex, you want the thing?" Because she'd been saving to buy one for herself, and so instead, I've been saving my tip money for a while. And so instead, what wound up happening is I did that, and she got to use almost all of her tip. I got to use it for tip. clothes. She got to use it for clothes. <laughs> anyway, so the camera. <laughs> oh, by the way, fun fact: I hurt my thumb again. I don't know if I ever showed you guys that I had sprained my thumb a while back. But yeah, now I have this handy little doohickey. And yeah, I, I hurt my thumb again. I think it was chicken fell it all over the fall. floor. I'm hurt by this. All over the floor. Did you zip it back before you left it? Great. You always zip it back. Anyway, so yeah, my thumb hurt because I was trying to cut, <laughs> I was trying to cut the packaging. I, I, I'm gonna have to put a picture cause I, I took a picture and sent it to my friends. I broke the scissors. <laughs> <On it. laughs> I just walked outside and I'm like, Richie, what? There's a, there's been a casualty. He's like, oh my god, you broke the camera already? I said you literally just got that thing. 
She shows me the scissors. <laughs> I took the scissors out from behind my back. I was very confused because I was looking at the box the entire time. There wasn't a scratch on that damn thing. No, <laughs> the camera's fine. But I did find it funny that everybody was like, hey, um, wait. You're getting, you're getting that camera, kind of like a GoPro thing? I was like, yeah, get it from my wife. She's been saving up for one, and they were like, you're using your five-year anniversary gift on your wife? I'm like, yeah. They went, that's really nice of you. Well, you're a very sweet guy. That's true. But yeah, it's so small. Oh my goodness. And it came with this protective case, but I'm charging it right now, obviously, since we just took it out. Um, Turns out, yes. It did in fact come with a, a micro SD. It's just, it came with a 16 gigabyte and it was inside the little baggie. Yeah, she and, didn't bother to look first. Well, everything else was outside the bag. Excuse Whoa. me for just assuming it wasn't in the bag. Yeah, apparently. Anyway, so now I have a 16 gig and a 32 gig. I'm not gonna complain about that, quite frankly. I, I probably will eventually get more 32 gigabyte I micro imagine. SD cards. Since that is the max that this little bitty camera can handle. But it's so small. It's so small. Also, you know what else is small? Look at it! It's such a tiny little tripod. It's so cute. All y'all's minds went in the gutter, didn't it? All your minds went in the gutter. You um, should all be ashamed. Because I joked about it earlier. Anyway, so yeah. It's a tiny little Not true. tripod. Tiny little tripod. So cute. Alright, let's see. Mm. Yeah, it's got a really annoying little bing bing sound. Oh, look at it. It's so tiny. Tie again. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, let's see what the, what 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 did you want to show? You want to show Ari? Oh yes, Ari's doing the uh. Writing. Ari has been writing, but I need to find it. Oh, yep. She was doing my okay. name and Richie's okay. names. Yeah. Let's what see. Is where is the page? Okay. What is the Turn page that you did it on? Every now and then I get a little bit tired. Turn around. Found it! What? I need you to stop talking for a little bit. But I am the best. But yep, so I let her pick the words, and what I do is I write it down. She traces it, and then she writes it herself. She wanted to do desk, since we're at a desk. And bucket, since we have a bucket. Huh. Doing very well. My wife is terrible at baking. Hey, you shush face. You shush face. You shush face. I just picked those up. Oh. <laughs> this is why we can't have nice things. You know what? You know what? Six and a half hours later. So, it is like. 9.30 and I had fallen asleep already. The girls are asleep. Richie was awake and we heard a sound. It woke. It was so loud it woke me up. Um, said that it sounded like a very big branch fell. And so Richie got up to check it out see if it was any of ours because it sounded big and uh, didn't see anything in the yard and so he decided to go and check on the neighbors make sure everyone was okay. A tree fell on one of our neighbor's houses. So the police and the fire department are over there right now. Richie's over there with them. Just letting them know 
know, what happened because he went over there. He was the one that called. The neighbors, thankfully, have evacuated. They were not at home, so they're safe. They had already evacuated. One of the other neighbors was able to find a way to get a hold of them, so they're, they're getting a hold of them, and Richie should be on his way, and I'm, of course, awake because my husband is outside during a hurricane, <laughs> and so I am low-key freaking out. But, yeah. From what he's said, yeah, it looks like everyone's leaving, so... That's good. Ronnie said nothing's really bad. The worst that it looks from his end is that it's going to be some roof damage. But other than that, foundation, structural, everything looks fine. So that's good. Yeah, I saw that their neighbors had their lights on to check it out. So that's a thing. Hopefully no other big trees fall <sighs> stressful That's the tree that fell. Y'all see it? Well, they brought their boat somewhere else. Baby! Baby, I love you! Yes, it's a drip light. <laughs> Bye, you. See how high the you is? Yeah, it's stuck. So we went, checked out the damage, and we just finished calling everyone, making sure everyone's okay. Uh, one of our friend's parents had a tree fall on their driveway, so thankfully they're getting someone to come over and cut that into bits and move it today, so that's good. But yeah, we went and checked out the tree that fell. And, yeah, they moved their boat to the other side of the house since apparently the owner knew that the tree was not doing very well and was trying to get it to cut, trying to get someone to cut it down, but they were kind of having some issues. And so the owner told the people running it, hey guys, I don't trust this tree. How about y'all vacate the house? And so they did. They moved their boat to the other side of the house. Um, and it's a good thing they did because that boat and probably both of their cars would be totaled. Y'all saw it. It did some damage to the corner of the roof and the carport. Very good. But remember, for peas, you need to make the line go down a little bit better, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But other than that, everyone's good. All three of our parents, my mom, my dad, and Richie's mom, all of their houses are without power right now. So my dad has a generator. I'm pretty sure my mom and them have a generator, but either way, they're, they're comfortable right now because usually whenever there's a hurricane coming, what you do is you set your AC 
much lower just in case the electricity goes out and then you know it has more time of cool air before it's unbearable so they're still comfortable right now my dad has a generator my grandparents have generators so everyone's good Richie's mom doesn't have a generator but she says she's good so far but we've already offered for her to come over if she changes her mind now we're just Hanging out. Iris is upset because she wants to go and jump in the muddy puddles, but the wind is still blowing hard enough that we don't want any branches to fall on her because we do have a water oak in our own front yard. And that's the type of tree that fell in our back neighbor's property. And so, yeah, we don't want any more branches falling. In fact, one branch fell and hit our mailbox. So our mailbox is a little bit more to the side than it normally is. Yep, yeah, it's, it's, it's a little crooked, huh? It's just a little crooked. So, once once the wind goes down, we'll probably let them go play in the water. Uh -huh. right. We're good so far. <laughs> what? That's silly. Oh, look, they're cutting down the tree. Yep. <sighs> so now that the wind has died down a lot, we're checking out the damage in the backyard and it's usual for a hurricane. So nothing too terrible, especially now that we cut down a bunch of our trees. Hi, Max. Yeah, I opened that door this morning. Since the worst of it had already passed, figured, well, we're gonna let the cats play around in the back area because I know they wanted to be let out. But no, during the worst of it, doors were closed. They were not allowed back there. Hi, baby. Whoop! <laughs> Does not like the wind. <laughs> what? You see the stick? Don't run at her, Aria. Hmm. We've had it worse. Mama, that, this one is red. <gasps> that one is red. Don't pull on it yet, okay? Got it. Got it. I see it. That one is red. I know. Let it. Let go it get. Red. Yep. Let go, Aria. <coughs> okay, we're gonna let it get bigger. Or at least. A deeper color red. Yeah. This thing didn't even move. And your mom was worried about it. It was at what? A cat five whenever it hit? I think so, yeah. It, it, it peaked at cat five with like a 168 degree wind. Or mile an hour wind. Degrees. Wow. No, but it was like 30 degrees apparently. Oh, maybe so. I don't know. All I know is that the temperature apparently dropped a lot. And uh, it was pretty steep. Didn't even knock the uh, didn't even knock the empty um, wheelbarrow over. It's not no, empty just, anymore. Yeah, I filled it up. Yeah, it's not empty anymore, but it didn't even knock that over. Okay, cool. Take a bite of your hot dog. I will. Okay, take a bite of your hot dog. Okay, take a bite of your hot dog. Iris, come take a bite of your hot dog, please. Here. You ready? Bye. Bye. <laughs> she hit her eyes. Whatever she Bye. Wait, hey, hang on. Sit down, please.